Bonjour, hello, welcome to Max Mountain World. And today, beautiful clear day this morning, a few clouds about, but big storms last night. It wasn't looking good last night, but it's looking good this morning. I've elected to get the car out to see what's happening. More mobility around the place, but I don't want to cross the line where the works are going to be. Finally made that decision this morning. So let's go and have a look. Just in the car park at 1800 and various activities going on. Things getting prepared across that area which I presume is for the helicopter. We have this uh, cable lorry, 6x6 wheel drive, chained up, serious piece of kit. And uh, some other stuff here, this uh, hydraulic thing that I discovered the other night. A huge roll, five tons of cable, right there in one uh, one roll. This being first thing in the morning-ish, then uh, yeah, gonna have some pretty weird light angles on the go here. But uh, see how we get on with it. Human dogs waiting to see what's going on here. Fair old little crowd of maybe a dozen people here. People filming for the station. And this sort of zoned off area. They've taken the tape away, I presume, because that would just blow havoc. So, we'll see what happens now. A lot of activity behind me here. People gathering from the station. Lots of stuff moving around. Bit of a waiting game. <laughs> Photographer's ready. Jungle adventure. It would be indeed. And if we can just catch the back of this. Fantastic cable. It's a quick view check. And just up here is, you can see the rock, La Roche. And just behind there, just behind the light green is where uh, that's going to arrive. So beautiful morning this morning, but due to change in a couple of hours' time. Beautiful sunny skies, a few wispy clouds about, bit of a system coming in. Clear skies, well, a couple of wee clouds, but that's it. The 360 in the car park at Lazar 1800. Mm. I'll take it this is the cable. As I saw the other night, quite a lot of info on it on the sticker. As I say the other night, I'm not going to be intrusive and zone in on that one, but pretty healthy cable anyway. Put it in perspective, about finger size, my finger size. And here's the stuff of a real photographer. Nice little tripod, Lumix camera, and Drone. And a few other things as well mixed in. Mm -hmm. 
Let's go skiing. First excitement <laughs> has arrived, it's going to depart. When it's departed, I'm going to go up the side there and I should have a good view of the two sides to see exactly what they're doing with it. So uh, quite a bit of excitement, a lot of folk filming with cameras, with phones, with all sorts of stuff and of course me here. So here we go, let's see what happens next. Il lâche le derrière. On a fait deux épices sur hier. Bon, ça compte là tout de suite. Ouais, bon, on verra pas. 
Re bonjour. Re hello. Okay, so this video started off last night down at 1650. Just because I wasn't sure what the weather was doing. And then commenced for this morning and all the stuff that you've just seen. So now, I thought I'd just take a wander up. It's only 500 feet higher. <laughs> uh, and just see what, what's what up here. I've already spotted the wire in place, so uh, I've got to have a wee look and see what happens. The problem is actually trying to get there. Uh, I think the best route's around the left there. I haven't gotten over that hump. Should have brought my wellies. <laughs> it's uh, kind of muddy. But uh, looks like the foundation's for a little building there. And you can just see if I go around this lot. And uh, there's the cable that went in this morning, if I can find it, yeah. When I was up here last, uh, I saw the base for that, I saw a little base for over there as well, and uh, also a base for here. Now this is obviously where the wire ends and takes its tension. It's, I don't know what's going to happen. I do remember vaguely what happened to the one I was at in Switzerland, but uh, you can see from here just exactly where it's going, right up to just to the left of the new restaurant up the top there. Hopefully I've got a bit. No, the Zoom's just not happy today. I don't know why. I got told that this is a hydraulic doofer that's going to use the smaller cable here to bring the full permanent uh, cable in and they're going to tow it all the way down from, from up the top there right down to here. This is only a wire to actually pull it apparently. Some heavy, heavy duty hydraulics going on there and look at this for a machine. Wow! Just got to zoom in a bit on the ga gauges and stuff. Awesome! So just now they seem to have the, the wire secured up there. Double drowned and double drowned that pylon there or that uh, concrete base for the pylon. These are the pylons that presumably are going to take the strain of it eventually. So you can just see the wires heading away. Okay so from there we have Mr. Cable. See how far I can follow this with the zoom. Bit of Pink Panther going on in the background. Oui, Greg. Oui. Bah écoute, nous, euh, on attend les recommandations de JB pour euh, relâcher un peu de tension. I've walked up here, it's probably about 5 or 6 kilometres, a climb of about 300 metres, 250, 300 metres, maybe not even that, 150, 500 feet or so. But anyway, keep subscribing, you'll keep up to date with all the stuff that's happening in this. I'm going to do loads more right up till when I'm actually on the thing at some point. Famous last words, there's a storm really coming in here, so shortcuts will take one of the mountain bike tracks. This is an old one that doesn't get used anymore. It's just a walkie track now, but yeah. Oh, bike park. Magic Woods. This is a black run. Wow, this is one of the difficult ones. So, still to be cleared up and tidied up for summer. But uh, yeah, take the quickest route down now. Save me getting a soaking. So, that is all that's left of the snow up here. Nothing else. There's all the works. Our stuff. And over there, a bit of sunshine in the distance, but the weather is coming from there, and I've already seen a few flashes, so I'm on my way. I'm just looking up behind here, I don't think this one's coming our way, but there's one hell of a thunderstorm going on over the other side there. Over towards Barcelonette, which isn't that far away in a straight line, it's only about 14-15 kilometres in a straight line, although about an hour and a half's drive by road. I don't know what's going to happen up here.
Okay, so just that's the Tyrolean wire. Now the guys were telling me that's the first wire and with the length of it, just over 1.8 kilometers, they then tow another wire with it and then another and then a fourth one. The fourth one is the final one. Uh, this is down to the tension capabilities of the smaller cables and the final cable, as I say, on the drum, and I said in the previous video that uh, <laughs> it's uh, five and a half tons. I don't think there's a helicopter that's going to be carrying that and they've obviously got their methods of uh, these machines that unroll it, that has huge brakes on them and everything. Obviously, I couldn't catch that all from down below, especially with my zoom playing up. I don't know what, I'll have to have a look at the settings on the camera. But, that's it. At the moment, I'm heading down. I'm surrounded by thunderstorms. I've got one ahead of me, one to the left, one behind, and one over there. But nothing here. Yet. Okay, so I better better head down anyway, better stop yapping and that. Anyway, nice to have a little walk up the mountain after work. And uh, that's it. So keep subscribing. You'll keep up to date with all the future videos that I'm putting up here, especially on this stuff. Not just radio stuff, all sorts of stuff going up on my channel. So follow what's going on, click on the alert bell, etc. Until the next video, thanks very much for watching. Ciao. <laughs> oh, throw the scotch. Wait for the pion car. Put the fire on. Voilà, c'est fait. Merci.